about time, detective. That wacko locked me up when he realized I'd uncovered his secret. You got that bag with the files, right? They're all his. Richard Hamilton's. He's been living here for all these years, spying on that preacher. We all thought he was just some quirky hermit. Looks like we've been had. I'm not sure what Hamilton's up to, but he's not gonna stop. The man's dangerous. And into dressing wounds? But never mind, I found Kate. Thank goodness! Is she alright? Is she safe? Not yet. We have to get her out of town. I've got a car, but it's parked far away. I'll never make it. Then go to the gas station and find Kate. I'll get the car. It's on my farm. Here, take the keys. And hurry!
Hamilton?
I have to take care of this tree. Take the car, Kate, and drive the two of you away from Maple Creek as fast as you can. Don't stop until you reach the city. Then pull over and find a phone. Call the police and tell them who you are. Won't you come with us, Detective? There's a serial killer on the loose here. I can't let him escape. Tell the police I said to send reinforcements pronto. Thank you, Detective. You've saved our lives. Detective, I found this in the church. I thought you might need it. Good luck. Pretty sure I know what this is for. Just need to find the rest of them. The church, the chapel, or the boathouse by the lake. They must be hidden somewhere there.
smart detective. Smarter than I thought. A great pity for us both. My bell, you silenced it before I could drain my puppets and fully revive. My congratulations. I'm helpless. Is it true? Did you murder all those women? Why? Who are you? I did. But the who and why are of no consequence to you. You'd neither believe nor understand. It doesn't matter. You'll do no harm to anyone anymore. What's behind that door? You know perfectly well, detective. But why not indulge your curiosity? have been lost on this altar of evil. I'll do whatever it takes to destroy it, if that means no one else is murdered here. Thank you, Detective. I knew you could solve it. Now, it's high time I close this case. I've been waiting for this moment for 30 years. Wait. I know who you are and what he has done. But he must be brought to trial. No. You have no idea who he is. What he is. He must be stopped. Once and for all, I'll kill him right here, right now. He'll suffer the same fate as his victims. Then you'll be no better than him! Think of Emily. Is this what she would have you do? Don't you dare speak her name. You can't stop me, detective. What are you doing? There will be no more murders here. Detectives? You're not looking so good. What on earth happened here? I need to debrief you as soon as possible. Detective? Can you hear me? You've done well, detectives. Kate Burroughs is here, safe in our custody. Her boyfriend is recovering at the hospital, and Maple Creek is finally at peace. However, we could find neither hide nor hair of the criminal, and Hamilton disappeared into thin air, too. Thank you again, detective. I owe my life to you, but I'm afraid I'll never feel safe with the killer still on the loose. He may have gone into hiding, but I haven't stopped hunting him. I never will.